I'd always told myself that I've driven every road in southern Alberta from Red Deer to Montana. Turns out I was lying. All it took was one left turn on the north side of the Red Deer River at Bindloss. And, yep, I was in country I'd never seen before. This road, one I'd never been on before, runs through native southern Alberta prairie. And any road that runs through native southern Alberta prairie is one I really want to be on. This is wild country out here along the Red Deer River. It's mostly grass, sagebrush, and cactus. And at this time of year, the Red Deer River is mostly just a series of wet sandbars. Away from the riverine forest, the cottonwoods, the water birch, the saskatoons and choke cherries. There's a vast expanse of native prairie grassland. There's antelope and mule deer like these guys out here. And glacial erratics all over the place. Big rocks that have been sitting here since the great glaciers melted away. And in the evening light, oh man, it's beautiful. The cone flowers and the patches of sunflowers catch the evening rays. And as the heat of the day seeps away, the bugs come out. The crickets buzz, the grasshoppers fiddle, and spiders get their supper. I'd told myself that since my truck had 754,000 kilometers on it, I'd driven every road in southern Alberta. Turns out, I was telling myself a lie. The great Yogi Berra once said, when you come to a fork in the road, take it. I am so glad that I did. <laughs> 